This is a blue hole. From the surface, it doesn't look like much. Just a swimming hole or a dark circle in a shallow sea. But what you're actually seeing is the entrance to a 330 foot deep cavern that opens into a massive underground world. I've been inside of one of these. I dove to 150 feet into an Abaco blue hole. And even from halfway down, it felt endless, like staring into the throat of the planet. And here's the strange part. Inside these holes, divers have found things no one expected. Ancient human remains, extinct animals, and secrets sealed away for thousands of years. Now stick with me, because the deeper we go, the more impossible this mystery becomes. The Bahamas hold more than a thousand blue holes, deep vertical sinkholes formed in limestone. Some sit inland, hidden in mangrove forests. Others open straight into the ocean, yawning like entrances to another world. For decades, locals avoided them. The water was too dark, the shapes too perfect, the legends too eerie. Then explorers and cave divers began to investigate. And what they found transformed these holes from curiosities into time capsules. Inside one of the Lucayan blue holes, divers uncovered a nearly untouched skeleton, a human who lived long before European contact. In another, they found the bones of extinct crocodiles and giant tortoises, species long gone from the Caribbean. The blue holes weren't just caves, they were underground museums, sealed shut by chemistry and time. So first, let's explore some of the mystery surrounding these blue holes. At first, no one understood how remains could so perfectly be preserved underwater. Bones don't last very long in the ocean. They get scattered, dissolved, and eaten. But the blue holes don't behave like normal water. Deep inside them lies a thick hydrogen sulfide layer, a milky barrier that blocks sunlight and chokes oxygen from the water beneath. No oxygen means no bacteria, and no bacteria means anything that sinks into the darkness can remain frozen in time untouched for thousands of years. It's why divers describe these caves as prehistoric vaults, underwater tombs, or even doors into the past. Shapes in the limestone look like carvings. Narrow passages feel like tunnels designed by human hands. Some researchers even wondered, were these places ritual sites, burial chambers, sacred spaces for the ancient Lucayans? The theories spiraled, and honestly, some of them sound convincing but the real explanation is even more extraordinary. Now, what the science says. The blue holes formed during the Ice Age, when sea levels were more than 300 feet lower than today. Back then, the Bahamas were a massive, dry, limestone plateau riddled with caves, tunnels, and pits. As the planet warmed and glaciers melted, the oceans rose, flooding the caves from below and sealing their contents inside. The hydrogen sulfide layer formed when decaying organic matter met trapped groundwater, creating a chemical boundary that acts like a lid. Below that layer, the water is still, silent, and timeless. There's almost zero oxygen, exactly the conditions you need to preserve bones, artifacts, even DNA. And scientists found something else inside the caves. Speleothems, ancient stalactites that only form in dry air. By analyzing the chemical signatures inside them, researchers can reconstruct thousands of years of climate history, including droughts, hurricanes, and megastorms that shaped early human migration. These caves aren't just archeological sites, they're climate archives, holding data we don't get anywhere else on Earth. One of the most remarkable discoveries came from a blue hold called Sawmill Sink. Divers found the remains of Lucayan man, perfectly preserved bones, teeth, even traces of diet and disease still intact. Nearby, they found bones of ancient birds, crocodiles, and extinct tortoises, proof that the Bahamas once hosted an ecosystem far different from today. The Lucayan people may have used some of these blue holes as burial sites, returning their dead to the places they believe connecting the living world to the spiritual one. Imagine being one of those early humans, carrying a torch into a pitch black pit, knowing that once the sea rose, these places would disappear forever. And yet, somehow, they preserved a part of themselves. But here's the catch. Exploring blue holes is incredibly dangerous. Divers must pass through total darkness. Visibility can collapse to zero in the hydrogen sulfide layer. Passages twist, narrow, and branch unpredictably. Even the best cave divers in the world describe the blue holes as supernatural, disorienting, and alive. 
One wrong move can stir up silt, closing the path behind you like collapsing snow. And yet, the farther they go, the more they find. The Blue Holes of the Bahamas are reminders that the ocean doesn't just hide creatures. It hides histories, worlds, lives. Preserved beneath the surface, untouched by time, they show us what the Caribbean once was, and who walked it long before us. Some mysteries lie in darkness, some in chemistry, and some in the courage to dive deep enough to find them. Thank you so much for watching, stay curious, and stay current.